Hi everyone, I'm not good at lying, and welcome to Cleithrophobia, or the fear of being locked in a small space. It looked like a really interesting game. It's using the most recent version of RPG Maker, which means it's not in a very tiny window uh, this time. It's actually coming up um, in a much larger window at a much higher resolution, and the graphics are bound to be much better than old RPG Maker games. I'm very interested in this game and really interested uh, to give it a shot, so let's go ahead and jump in. I've already tested the game to make sure my recording equipment was working correctly, and it is. So, Jordan Wright presents. Alright, so I seem to be Laura Croft from Tomb Raider. A lantern. Just what I needed. Alrighty. The graphics are much better than most RPG Maker games I've played. There's a floor hole in the ground here. We've got some nice bushes. And very interesting shadows. You see that? It's dynamic shading. That's awesome. In an RPG Maker game, I never would have expected it. Anything else in this room? Doesn't look like it. And I can move in six axis. Okay. There is something on the table. I found the bedroom key. Where does that go? I wonder. Not that way. Unless... Oh, okay. I can save. Save to file one. Item. Good stuff. Liking the audio. A very basic kick. Use the key? Yes. The key unlocks the door. Alright, so this doesn't seem to be a very tight space. I don't know what they're talking about with that, but... Got another one of these plants. Man, these graphics are awesome. I'm loving the shading. Like, I never thought I'd see that in an RPG Maker game. I never thought I would, but here it is, so. Loving that. Got ourselves a bed. It's not as talkative as most uh, RPG Maker games go. Just an old dusty mirror. Inspect it? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. All right. So the graphics are much better. All right. So lock the door. Let's not look into mirrors this time. It's probably for the best. Um, let's go back through here. Not looking in mirrors. Some blood on the floor, I'm assuming. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. There seems to be something behind this wallpaper. But I can't yet get to it. Is that a handprint? That's a big ass handprint. Alright. Um, through the top. There's a book on the table. It reads, He is out there hiding in the shadows. In the mirrors, he's there. He watches you, then he gets you. He came after me, now look where I am. Oh, fuck. I no longer want to move in that direction. Um, alright. Shelves containing plates and cutlery. There is something on the shelf. Pick it up. Oh. I didn't pick it up. Good. I'm going to save before I do that. Alright. Yes. I found a bottle of white vinegar. Alright. <clears throat> um. Okay. Well, it's definitely got a creepy atmosphere. Down. There's a smashed bottle on the floor. There's a large gla glass shard near it. Pick it up. I picked up the item glass shard. Yeah, the link to this game will be in the description below if you guys want to check it out, but it's looking really cool for an RPG Maker game so far. I have no idea what to expect. I think it's fairly new, if I'm not mistaken. But I'm sufficiently scared enough to hold my breath. Just a painting, a candle. Is that a key? There's a key on the table. Take the key. Yes? There's a key stuck to a chain on the table. <laughs> 
told me that beforehand, but whatever. Definitely very, very nice for an RPG Maker game. Oh my god, it's a long hallway. Okay. Oh, with nothing in it, no less. Okay. Um. So what do I do about that? So this. Just a part of the wall. So there's really nothing in here whatsoever. Just a big empty room. Alrighty. So we can't get the key, I don't think. Did I have anything to do that? I guess I could try using the glass shard. Oh no, I gotta use that on the wallpaper in here. Okay, we got this down. So apparently there's some guy watching me from the mirrors. Uh, because he's a creep. And... I hate the multiple presses for that. That's one thing I would fix if I could. There's a safe behind this wallpaper. Oh good, so it's something I can't use yet. Oh, nope, not with that many. I was thinking I might be able to guess it. The password didn't work. Okay. So where am I going? Guys, I cannot overstate how much the graphics are improved in this versus a regular RPG Maker game. I've played a lot of them. But I suppose they were all kind of old. There's nothing back here, right? Just a big empty hallway. Okay, there was something there. You guys see that, right? It's not just me? Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Okay, let's start moving backwards now. Any kind of movement whatsoever would be awesome. Okay, he chases me through doors. We can leave. So is this gonna be something like Al Oni? Oh, shit. Oh, I went the wrong way. Fuck! Alright. I almost want to cut the video here. Um, I actually will. I'm going to cut the video here just so you guys have a chance to go play this game before we get any farther in. If you want to continue, part two will be up there. Uh, or over there, really. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did like the video, comment on the video, subscribe to the video, or me. Hope you guys are having a great night, a great weekend. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you later.